Recently, I have been considering what it means to live a good life. It's easy to find purpose in achievements or milestones, progress, but oftentimes when you reach the top of the mountain and you sit back and you take in the view, you can't help but wonder, what is all of this for? in the morning we're in Mount Hood in the Mount Hood area and I think it's about time we finally made it to Washington let's go there are two quotes that I lean on for understanding the purpose of life the first is from Alan Watts he says the meaning of life is just to be alive, and yet everybody rushes around in a great panic as if it were necessary to achieve something beyond themselves. And the second quote is from Rumi, and he says, gamble everything for love if you are a real human being. I've had quite some time to sit with these words as I drive this bus around the country, and I've taken it upon myself to create a personal life philosophy inspired by these teachings. From these two quotes, I have created a personal life philosophy to help me determine if I'm on the path of living a good life. And it goes like this, am I doing it for love and will it change me? So it's just a little after eight o'clock. I'm done with dinner. I can't camp here overnight. I can't park here overnight. There's signs posted everywhere that I gotta go. And I have no idea where I'm sleeping, where I'm camping tonight. And it's already after eight. <laughs> These are the cheap thrills of bus life, baby. I love it. I want to camp in this little town. There's a little marina parking lot right downtown, right on the water. And it's two hour parking until 11 o'clock at night. But then there's no, no overnight parking signs. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to tidy up here. And then when it starts to get a little darker, I'm going to head over to that parking lot and see if I can get away with sleeping there overnight. And I have no idea how it's going to go, but that's life, baby, isn't it? I'll see you when we're, when we're sneaking. Rhea, you ready? Let's go find camp. We're gonna try to call this home for the night. Maria should clear out once the restaurants close. The world feels like magic today. I don't know what's going on, but today is a great day. There is a simplicity and a thrill for this philosophy I've created for myself. Love and evolution are frankly two of the most terrifying things. They are risky, but I have come to the conclusion 
that pursuing love and evolution together and above all else is the key to living a good life. When you ask yourself the question, am I doing it for love and will it change me? Oh my gosh, you just quickly realize what is and is not important. You realize if there are other forces at play, like ego or competition, and most powerfully, you realize the goodness that you're too afraid to reach for. Maybe there's a decision you're making that is holding you back from something beautiful. When people are on their deathbeds, the memories that come to mind are the ones that brought meaning to their life. I'm not going to remember my road trip itinerary or the money I made or spent or how many views this video gets. I'm not going to remember because those things didn't change me and I didn't love them. But I will remember my summer romance. I'll remember being so frustrated with myself and wanting to be a better version of me so badly. I'm going to remember skinny dipping in the ocean on a belly full of champagne because in the moment I did it, it symbolized something more. And I'm going to remember these things because somehow they changed me and somehow love was the reason. I gotta say, it's been a pretty eye-opening experiment to ask myself this question more often. I've found that when I answer yes to the question, life feels more special and I have a sense of peace even when the path forward is unclear. I still just feel like I'm living a meaningful life. And on the flip side, when my answer is no, lately that's been pointing to areas of myself that I need to nurture. And it feels good to have a good grasp on that too. Whatever life looks like for you, I hope it changes you and I hope you love your damn hardest. <laughs>